Tonight, an update to a special report we brought you a few weeks ago when CBS 17's Crystal Price looked into safety concerns over ATV and dirt bike riders in Durham and the traffic hazards it created. Well, tonight we've learned that a landowner wants to donate property where these ATV riders can go. Now, when people report that these ATV riders are causing problems on the roads, police have told us that it's too dangerous for them to chase these riders. But by building more trails, one ATV club is hoping that this will help get more of these ATV riders off the streets. This culture is, uh, is growing rapidly. <laughs> Jamal Lewis is president of the Southern Soul ATV Club. His group goes on rides every month in Durham. And yes, they do have to ride on the roads to get to their trails. One of my purposes was to uh, try to get these young kids off the street and really give them something to do. While Lewis says his group obeys the traffic laws, we've shown you other groups causing traffic hazards for motorists. You know, I was fighting, you know, trying to uh, get new trails for these kids to get them out the, uh, get them out the street. Shortly after our special report aired. I'm gonna ride down that way. We can, we can. Lewis met with Brian Stoner, who decided to donate 140 acres of his land in Rougemont. New ATV trails can be built. We we love we love their mission. We, are we support anything where you have enhanced mentorship? So to be able to do my dream and have somebody to help me help somebody else. That's just amazing. This is what we're gonna try to change lives out here. While they have the land, Lewis says he needs help with building the trails. So they're starting a GoFundMe page to help pay for machinery. While he's hoping to get these dirt bikers off the streets, he's also looking forward to mentoring even more kids in Durham. If I can, if I can get a bunch of those kids to follow behind me and listen, you know, we could change a lot of the, a lot of the future. In Rougemont, Crystal Price, CBS 17 News.